So today's video is going to be on how I take my mirror selfies. I asked you all in a previous video what you wanted to see and someone left a comment asking if I could do this and a lot of you thumbs it up so that is what I'm doing today. But before I get into it I just want to quickly say that while it's great to know how to take a good picture and look the best you possibly can, there's so much more important things in life and don't let Instagram consume you. A lot of what you see on there isn't a true representation of how people live or how they look. A lot of it is photoshopped or like pictures of breakfast that they don't actually eat. So don't compare yourself to anybody on there and just be yourself. Oh, that's so cliche, but it's so true. And yeah, with all of that said, I still really hope you like this video and maybe get a few tips from it. And yeah, let's get into it. The butterflies on my insides have all gone away. Okay, so at first I had literally no idea how I was going to film this video, but I think it would probably be best if I do it on my phone. So first off, if I just stand like this, I don't look very tall and my legs don't look that great in it. So if you go on your tiptoes, it instantly just gives you a bit more height and it also just makes your legs look a lot more toned really, so that's why I stand like this. And I'll usually just kind of stand in this position and I usually have kind of like my jacket or something off the shoulder because it just kind of makes you look a little bit taller again. And then I just elongate my neck and then I'll probably pose like this. And then that would be like the first pose and it's so simple but I do feel like you forget sometimes, especially I do, I'll be like taking a picture and I'll be like, my legs look so short, why do they look so short? But yeah, if you just go on your tiptoes, it instantly gives you that height. Sometimes I'll stand like this and have like a leg out and again, I'll be on my tiptoes and it just gives you a bit more height and also elongates this leg. So I like to do this when I've got dark colored jeans on because I think it just suits it better. I literally just stand like this the whole time <laughs> and yeah that's basically it for this mirror so another thing I do if I'm sitting on the floor um, if I sit like this my legs just do not look very long at all they look so short so what I do is I kind of sit at an angle first bend the leg up a bit and put it towards the mirror without knocking the mirror over and if you hold the camera a little bit further back it also just gives you that bit of height as well and then I'll just rest my arm back and kind of lean back and stretch my little short neck out and yeah so on to my full length mirror selfies I've gotten changed again just because I think the black jeans and the black boots look so much better for these kind of pictures I always go for a heel when I'm doing a full length one just because it just makes the legs look so much better so basically if I stand like this my legs don't look very long at all so what I do is I put this first leg out like this and I put all of my weight onto this back leg and then I kind of arch the leg up a little bit like that and then it instantly makes your legs look so much more longer. Or again, you could just kind of arch this one out a little bit and bend it slightly. It's all about kind of arching your legs and putting your weight back onto this one. So also I do do some sitting down ones in this mirror and all I do is again, just position this leg out towards the end of the mirror and I kind of like fold this one under. And sometimes I'll rest my arm on my leg like this. I'll like put this leg forward again but you don't want to rest it down you just want to kind of like push it out a bit and I'll lean back on this arm again and yeah that's basically it <laughs> so sometimes I'll also sit on something like this and from this obviously my legs do not look very long at all they look so short right now so what I do is I pull this leg right out like that and then with this leg I won't leave it like this because obviously it doesn't look very long so I'll kind of bend it out slightly but have it the majority out if that makes sense and then I'll just kind of like position myself on this I'm actually falling off this right now so I can't really show you ah okay that's better sometimes I'll also kind of rest my arm on my legs too and I do feel like that makes it look longer I'm not really sure why it just does but basically the main kind of gist of the whole thing is to stretch your legs out as much as you can um It'll probably be quite uncomfortable, but it does make a really good picture. And yeah, that's basically what I do. And just kind of position your hands and your neck and your arm back and maybe lean back and stuff like that. It's just about kind of finding the best positions that work for you. But these are just the ones that I do and kind of go to. I'm sure there's other ones that will be better for you or ones that I don't know about yet. But yeah, that's basically what I do. I really hope you liked this video. Let me know if you do and if it helped. I don't know if this was really basic or if a lot of you will find it helpful. I really don't know. Have an amazing day and I'll speak to you all again very, very soon. Bye.